All right, anytime that we're installing these outlets inside of the big vanity cabinets, homeowners love it. It's one of their favorite features of the house. This way they can charge their toothbrushes, their razors, whatever it is inside of that, and keeping your vanity tops nice and clean. Let me show you how easy it is to do that. All right, so here's what you're going to need. You're going to need an old work box. So it's an electrical box that has these little flappy things. And also you're just going to need a simple outlet. It does not need to be a GFI outlet because our GF, those outlets are connected to the main GFI outlet right here. So anything ever trips, that outlet right there would trip. All right, now I'm just going to use my oscillating tool. I'm using this Hitachi one uh, to just make those cuts that we marked. All right, so we see our wire there, but because this is a half inch plywood and that's a half inch piece of drywall, the thickness of this is too big for us to be able to turn those flaps. So what you're gonna do is get your screwdriver and just chip out some of this um, drywall here so that the flaps can hang on to the vanity um, cabinet itself. All right, now that we have room for that and we have our wire through our box, we can then go ahead and wire our outlet now and then set the box. If you don't have your wire back there, because most of you guys don't, we do because we knew we were going to put something there. What you would do is cut out that hole, go in your attic, drill a hole in that same cavity, drill a hole, then be able to feed a wire down into there. And then out of this box, what you would do is then run a snake up into the attic to catch that wire and bring it down and connect it here. So you would connect it here, bring it, bring it, bring it over to the other side and then connect it there. That's what you're going to do. Now let's just wire this up. Okay, so that's all done. All that's left is to test it to see if it works. It works. So doing this is one of the easiest way to give value to your homeowners, to your customers. This literally costs us in materials 30 bucks for both for that side and this side. But this is something that the homeowners will awe over. Every time we do this, they're like, oh, you love that feature. This is so cool. Um, so definitely try to do that. It's super, super easy. Hope this helped you guys. Have a good one.